How to create and use Safari tab groups in iOS 15 on iPhone and iPad. How to change the address bar position. Open the Safari browser. At the bottom left corner, next to the address bar, tap on the AA icon. Then tap on the show top address bar option. To change it back, tap on the AA icon again and select show bottom tab bar. How to create a tab group. Open the Safari browser. Tap on the two square icon. Then tap on the tab name. You can either select the new empty tab group to create a tab group with the Safari start page and add the tabs later, or select the second option to create a tab group with all open tabs. Name the tab group. When done, tap on save. How to rename tab group. Open the Safari browser. Tap on the two square icon. Tap on the tab name. Tap and hold the tab group you want to rename until a menu pops up. Then tap on rename. Enter the new name for the tab group and tap on save. How to move tab to a tab group. Open the Safari browser. At the bottom right corner, tap on the two square icon. Locate the tab you want to add, tap on it and hold while a menu pops up. Then tap on move to tab group, tap on the tab group name to move it to that tab group. How to view all tab group tabs. Open the Safari browser. At the bottom right corner, tap on the two square icon. You'll see all the tabs that are in the selected tab group. To see tabs in other tabs groups, tap on the tab group name at the bottom and select the tab group name. Or you can swipe left or right on the bottom address to view all tabs. How to arrange tabs in a tab group. Open the Safari browser. At the bottom right corner, tap on the two square icon. Find the tab you want to move, tap and hold it until a menu appears. Now, select Arrange Tabs by Title or Arrange Tabs by Website, or you can tap and hold the tab until the menu appears, and then drag it to where you want it to be. How to close all except one tab in a tab group? Open the Safari browser. At the bottom right corner, tap on the two square icon. Locate the tab you want to keep, then tap and hold it until a menu pops up. Tap on Close Other Tabs. How to close one or all tabs in a tab group. Open the Safari browser. Then tap and hold the two squared icon until a menu pops up. Tap on Close All Tabs or select Close This Tab if you want to close only one tab. How to delete a tab group. Open the Safari browser. Tap on the two square icon. Tap on the group tab name at the bottom. When a menu pops up, tap and hold the tab group you want to delete until a menu pops up. Then tap on delete. Or lightly swipe left on the tab group you want to delete. And tap on the red trash button. Hopefully, this video provided the information you were looking for. If you're using a Mac computer, we would like to suggest scanning it with Combo Cleaner. It will check your computer for malicious software infections and advertising supported software. Combo Cleaner also offers a disk cleaner that will help you clean out the junk accumulated on your Mac. A big files finder that will help you find files that take up the most space on your Mac. A duplicate file finder, which will easily find all duplicate files on local and external hard drives. A privacy scanner that will help you remove cookies, cache, browse history and more. And an app uninstaller that will find all hidden app components and uninstall them for you. You won't need to worry about viruses and clutter on your Mac anymore. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel.